Neutron stars, nebula, and galaxy groups are just some of the strange and amazing things you can find in space. Black holes are one of the coolest things that can happen. Since German astronomer Carl Schwarzschild predicted their appearance in 1916, scientists have learned a lot about the giants that are hard to find. As science gets better, scientists are beginning to learn more about how black holes work. There are magnetic swirls, radio wave jets, plans for wormholes, and explosions that set a world record. Stargazers have seen everything and are starting to find answers to some of the questions that people have been asking for years. Number 8. Astronomers Capture Magnetic Swirls Around the Rim of a Black Hole In 2019, astronomers made history when they showed the world the first shot of a black hole's edge. You can't take a picture of a black hole. A new picture was taken of M87, a supermassive black hole 55 million light years away. Scientists used data from the Event Horizon Telescope, a world network of detectors, to make the picture. Two years later, the scientists showed a second picture that showed even more important information about how the strange celestial giants behave. This was another never-before-seen feat of science. In March of 2021, scientists shared a third picture of M87. This time, magnetic field lines were spiling around the shadow of the galaxy. Black holes like M87 are surrounded by a burning ring of hot stuff from space. Scientists looked at the light coming from this place and the direction of the waves. People know that black holes send out huge jets of matter, but no one knows why. Scientists think that the magnetic swirls will help them figure out what's going on with this strange event. Number 7. Observatories Detect Record-Breaking Explosion NASA's Chandra X-ray Observatory started getting strange readings from deep space in 2016. In the Ophiuchus Galaxy Cluster, which is 390 million light-years away, a strange curve formed. Scientists didn't believe at first that it was made by a black hole because the amount of energy that would have been needed seemed too big to be true. But as more information came, there is more and more proof. NASA finally released that they had found the biggest explosion ever seen in the universe. Galaxy groups are some of the biggest things that have been found in the universe. They are made up of dark matter, hot gas, and millions of galaxies. At the heart of the Ophiuchus cluster is a very large galaxy with a very large black hole. Scientists think that the huge space eater caused the huge blast. The explosion is said to have made five times as much energy as the previous record holder. A huge explosion in the galaxy cluster MS0735-74. Simona Gianciatucci, who led the study, linked the blast to the 1980 eruption of Mount St. Helens that tore its top off. The main difference is that you could line up 50 Milky Way galaxies in the crater that this explosion made in the hot gas of the cluster. Number 6. Supermassive black holes could be wormholes in disguise. Wormholes are tubes in space that can take people from any place in our universe and maybe even to another. Albert Einstein thought that wormholes might exist more than 100 years ago. But no one knows for sure. Astronomers have been looking for years for proof that wormholes exist or that they don't exist. In November 2020, though, researchers said in a study that they may have found them by accident. Mikhail Piotrovich thought that some black holes might actually be openings to wormholes. Black holes and wormholes are more alike than you might think. Both are very heavy and have strong gravity pulls. The main difference is that nothing can get out of a black hole once it goes in. But anything that goes into a wormhole could, in theory, get back out. Piotrovich and his friends think that keeping an eye on gamma ray emissions might help them show that their interesting idea is true. Number 5. Black holes merging causes light of a trillion stars. People know that black holes hide in the pitch blackness of space and collide and merge. Scientists thought until recently that this process happened in the dark and couldn't be seen. Now, scientists think that when two black holes collide, they release a rush of light a trillion times brighter than the Sun. In 2019, the gravitational wave detector LIGO found a bright flare that scientists think was caused by the merger of two black holes near a third black hole. 
The gas and dust around the collision work as floodlights, shining light on the disaster. This supermassive black hole had been humming along for years before this sudden flare, the study's lead author, Matthew Graham, said. We think that the flare is most likely caused by two black holes joining together. Number 4. Scientist Photograph Jet of Radio Waves The Event Horizon Telescope, or EHT, is an outstanding engineering feat. It is made up of eight radio observatories that are spread in different parts of the world. When their information is put together, it makes a huge, accurate telescope the size of the Earth. In July 2021, the EHT project made a set of pictures that show a black hole sending out radio waves. It is known that the black hole at the center of the Centaurus A galaxy gives off a lot more energy than the one in the Milky Way. But this is the first time that scientists have seen such a clear picture of a black hole sending matter into the sky. Scientists can now take pictures of the big jets with 10 times more accuracy and 16 times more detail than they could before. Number 3. Researchers detect a black hole gobbling up a neutron star. Black holes and neutron stars are some of the most dense and strange things in the universe. When they hit, everything starts to burn. A crash is a bad thing that happens. When the two titans crash into each other, they do so with so much force that huge waves spread through space and time. In the past few years, scientists have seen two black holes and two neutron stars collide. But until recently, it was much harder to take a picture of a black hole and a neutron star coming together. After a long time of waiting, two came at once. In January 2020, astronomers found proof that two black holes and neutron stars merged within 10 days of each other. Scientists say that both disasters happened about a billion years ago. Because space is so big, it took until last year for cosmic echoes to reach Earth. In both cases, the black hole was so big that it ate the neutron star. Number 2. Astronomers Puzzled by Black Hole with Impossible Mass in the year 2020, scientists found a black hole collision that, according to theory, should have been impossible to find. At least one of the Goliaths was 85 times as heavy as the Sun, which experts thought was too heavy for such a crash to happen. When the two crashed into each other and merged, they made a black hole that is about 150 times heavier than the Sun. That is bigger than any black hole that has ever been found. People think that the far-off merging happened when the world was only half as old as it is now. A theoretical astrophysicist named Ilya Mandel said that the finding was wonderfully unexpected. Number 1. Are black holes a source of near-infinite energy? Sir Roger Penrose is a major figure in the field of astronomy. He is a British scientist. In 1969, he suggested that black holes could be used to power future societies. In theory, something near a black hole but not inside it should gain negative energy. Penrose thought that the object should be cut in half, with one half going into the black hole and the other going away. The energy from the black hole should have been given to the half that moved away. If the energy could be used, it could power the whole world. As things stand now, technology isn't even close to being able to do something like this. Was Penrose, on the other hand, right? In 1971, scientist Yakov Zeldovich suggested that Penrose's far-fetched idea could be tested right here on Earth. Unfortunately, Zeldovich's plan also couldn't work, because technology couldn't do it. In June of 2020, more than 50 years after Penrose first came up with the idea, scientists at the University of Glasgow were finally able to prove his theory. The team put together a ring of speakers to make the spinning effects of a black hole. Then they watched as sound wave beams got bent and twisted, just like Penrose's original object. We couldn't be happier that, 50 years after the theory was first proposed, we were able to test some very strange physics. Professor Danielle Faccio says so. It's weird to think that we were able to prove a 50-year-old theory about the universe in our lab in the west of Scotland. But we think that it will lead to a lot of new scientific discoveries. Thanks for watching this video.